What's up? What's going on? This morning, I thought I'd get my handy dandy little tape measure here and um, just have a little bit of fun and answer a couple of questions that I don't get asked too often but I have got asked recently and that is how big are my arms and how big are my legs? So it's not going to be a very long video at all. Uh, first of all I'm going to go and um, have a coffee and then I might feel a little bit more positive about talking because this morning I'm tired as fuck. <laughs> But that seems to be the way I am every morning at the moment. Now, you know what, fuck it, we're not going to do the coffee. Let's just do this right now. So, a little bit of history. Uh, when I was cutting, when I was feeling really depleted, this is probably about 10 months ago, 9 or 10 months ago, I, I measured my arms. Uh, they came in at 16 inches on the dot. Um, I also me uh, measured my... Uh, legs, my quads and calves. My quads came in at 24 and a half inches and you know that was quite low for me. I'd never seen my quads under 25 inches before um, and this is around about the time that I decided to call off that contest prep because I just saw myself wasting away. I was just getting too too skinny, I was losing muscle and you know I knew deep down that all I wanted to do was actually get bigger and that's why I started the series. So anyways 16 inches arms my quads were 24 and a half and my calves were just under 16 inches. So, uh, what have we done since then? Well, we bulked up from about 88 kg to 105. What I did then, I, I cut from 105 down to about 100 and that's where we're at now. So, I've been bulking again for two weeks or a week and a half. Um, I was I was going to name this video what damage did I do in Thailand what you know what was the damage to my muscle gains to my size but to be quite fair with you guys um, I haven't lost any size to be honest I took two weeks off the gym and got drunk for ten days in a row and all that happened was I got a little bit leaner um, I definitely lost some fullness but that didn't take long to get back and right now I'm feeling pretty much as I was um, at you know 100 102 kg. Uh, before. So anyways, with that being said, let's get this tape measure out. It does have a little split in it, that's because <laughs> it's quite old now, but um, I think I got this for free in a supplement order. But anyways, let's pull this up first and see what it says. So, is that about right guys? I don't know. I think that's about right. So it's saying 43 on the dot, if I can put that up there. Don't know if that's going to focus, but anyways, 43 centimetres. Uh, that's the right arm. Let's do the left arm. It would seem, oh fucking hell, my left arm's slightly, slightly uh, smaller actually, which doesn't, doesn't make me feel too happy. I want symmetrical arms. Um, right, so the first one was 43 centimeters, which if we can focus, which we probably can't, uh, 43 turned over is bang on 17 inches. And the other one was 42 and 3 quarters, and that was 16 and 7 eighths. So the arms are sitting around around 17 inches at the moment. Give me another couple of weeks of training, they'll definitely be at 17 um, every morning. So with that said, let's do the legs, shall we? This is going to be interesting, actually. Right. 
That's about right. 67, 67 centimeters. Go to the left one. That's about, it's about 67 as well. So uh, we'll do the calves. Sitting at. Forty. Honestly, guys, my calves are my calves are pretty small. To be fair, um, they're not big. Yeah, it's about a forty. So 67, 67 centimeters for the quads, and what was it? Forty centimeters for the calves. So let's check that out. The sixty-seven is twenty-six. Uh, 26 and a half inches for my quads, which is a gain of two inches from 10 months ago, which is great. Although I'm obviously I've got more body fat, but you know I really don't care. I just want to be bigger, so that's pretty good. And that was 67 centimeters on both legs, so they're both they're both about 26 and a half inches, and my calves were about 40, and that is just under 16 inches. So my calves haven't changed, and I'll tell you guys the reason for that, and that is because I haven't trained them. So what can I expect? Um, <laughs> but yeah, that's that's not too bad, is it? So what do we got? Like, what what are my stats right now? I've got 17 inch arms, 26 and a half inch quads, 16 inch uh, calves, and let's do actually one more thing: forearms, because someone actually asked me that the other day. So I've never I've never measured my forearms actually. So let's. How am I going to do this? What do we got? 30... 33? We'll call that 30... 32 and a half or 33 in that one. And that is about 30, 33, no, 32, 32 and a half for both, I'd say. So, what is it? 32 and a half is about 12 and 7 eighths inches. So, it's just, just under 13 inches. So, what have we got? 26 and a half inch quads, 16 inch calves, 17 inch arms, and 13 inch forearms. So... That's where we're at, guys. Day 270 of making gains. We've got three months to go. Nine months we've been doing this. Definitely gonna make it to day 365 for anyone who's wondering. That is gonna be the final day of making gains. I'm not sure if I'm gonna cut down yet. Depends where we're at. Um, I'm hoping to be definitely over 105 kilo and um, I'll be feeling happy, good, strong, and all that good stuff. So yeah, quick video. That's where we're at. Keep watching for more. I'm not sure what the content's gonna be, but I'm sure I'll think of something. And in the meantime, train hard, eat well, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Nothing can stop me, I'm all the way up. Oh.